गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन एंड वेलकम टू मॉर्निंग ऑन कॉल फर्स्ट विल स्टार्ट विद टेक्निकल एंड डेवलपडेटे वी सी दिफ्टी कंटिन्यू ट्रेड विद नेगेटिव बायस यू कुड सी अ गैप डाउन ऑफ स्मॉल ऑफ थर्टी ऑट पॉइंट एंड दिस वॉज अ सेकेंड कंटिन्यूटेटिव डे विथ लोज इज डे ओवरऑल सेक्टोरल फ्रेंड इट वॉज अ ब्रॉड बेस्ड सेक्टर सेलिंग हाउ एवर मेजर वीकनेस वॉज सीन इन द मिड कैप्स एंड स्मॉल कैप on the daily chart if we see then first we broke the 17800 level and yesterday in the, in the jcb also broke the 17500 level and we made a low near about 17467 or level and if we see this correction may also lead further because if we see the retracement level from 15183 we made a short term bottom to 17992 the whole rally of the 23% retracement comes to 17330 so there could be an intermediate support over there And if you breach those levels also, then 38.2% that is 16919 also can be uh, come if we breach 17330. And below that, if we open, then 16500 could be the last filter wave. And if that is also breached, then there would be a loss of momentum and change in trend also. Uh, till uh, until unless we hold 17300, we may find some support over there. And if if this is gone, then we should exit our longs and uh, stay away from the market and does not settle down. On the bank Nifty also, if we see, then it was trading with a negative bias, and it also opened with a gap down. Uh, sorry, it opened with a down with 500 odd points, and it was consolidated in a small range for the rest of the trading session. And if we see, then as per a derivative rate, also 38,000 wave is put trading over there, which is acting as an immediate support. So in the bank Nifty, we are more uh, negative than Nifty, and and we can see another 2,000 point of correction, which cannot be ruled out. On the derivative front, so if we see then Nifty futures, oh, I saw a long repetition to the tune of six percent. That is reduction of zero point nine zero million share, and total outstanding current position stands at thirteen point nine million share. On the advance decline ratio was also negative with nineteen stocks on gaining side and seventeen stocks on the losing side. PCR oil also was on the uh, also saw a downtick to the tune of zero point seven nine as compared to zero point eight eight. On the options front, if we see the major put or writing was seen at seventeen five hundred six hundred, which will now act as a caution. But seventeen five hundred is taken out, so it will uh, hamper more. And on the call front, if we see the seventeen seven hundred seventeen eight hundred saw that is four point nine five one point eight five million shares each. Bank Nifty futures also, if we see then we saw long liquidation in the index that is reduction by twelve point four percent. That is four lakh twelve thousand shares. And on the rollover, if we see then rollover is more morely flattish thirty four percent. As per thirty five percent in the last expiry, and on the bank Nifty, if we see that thirty two percent compared to thirty percent, and on the FI data, if we see then uh, FIs were led short by only six twenty six contracts yesterday. They bought five thousand four twenty five thousand four hundred contracts. So overall, if we see then FIs are fifty fifty in the index. They are not able to gauge the view in which side they should go. And then unless the long and the long short ratio is fifty, and then unless it does not short heavily. So we'll, we FIs we can't use the more over there. So that's it for uh, Acha. And the report qualification we are given by in Asian Paints put option thirty three fifty put we can buy in the range of thirty uh, to thirty four with a stop loss of ten and target of seventy two. With that over to uh, Varun sir. Thank you. Thank you, Hitendra. So uh, from a uh, couple of updates from research side uh, first on. Uh, Lemon Tree Hotels, a company has announced its latest signing of Lemon Tree Hotel Hubli and Karnatak. This property is expected to be operational by May 2023 and shall be managed by Carnation Hotels Private Limited, a subsidiary and the management arm of Le Lemon Tree Hotels. This property will feature 65 uh, rooms, complemented by a restaurant, bar, spa, swimming pool, fitness center, and a meeting room. So, uh, this is a positive development for Lemon Tree Hotels. Uh, we expect uh, that by FY25, Lemon Tree will uh, have uh, ten thousand, uh, close to eleven thousand rooms and hundred and ten hotels. Uh, we have a hold rating on the company with a target price of seventy-eight. Uh, next update is on Indian hotels. The company has announced opening of a Ginger Hotel in Ahmedabad. Uh, so this new addition will feature hundred and eleven rooms, including suites. The hotel will also include all-day dining restaurant. a uh, cumin it has also announced opening of first vivanta hotel in ahmedabad uh, uh, so this hotel will feature 176 rooms and suites uh, so overall this is a positive de development for the company 
Uh, next update is on TCS. So company has announced that it has been selected by South Africa's APSA Corporate and Investment Bank to digitally transform its banking services. As a part of this deal, TCS will leverage the TCS Bank's platform to help the company provide on-cloud and investment services for APSA's client. Uh, we understand that uh, the bank platform is now being used across 450 locations around the world and covers more than 1 billion accounts for banking network globally. So this is a positive de development for TCS. Uh, Infosys has announced 70% variable pay only. Uh, we believe this will help the company in addressing margin pressure, uh, considering most IT companies indicated either delay or lower variable pay. We believe that supply side pressures have eased now. However, uh, this uh, might impact growth as well. Uh, hence, we recommend uh, as an investor to be either in large caps like Infosys and TCS or in mid caps, which has higher exposure to BFSI and uh, uh, United States of America. Uh, so for example, companies like LTI. Uh, next update is on uh, FMCG sector. So. As per Kantar, uh, so Kantar is an FMCG agency which has come out with its overall report. So it says that FMCG sales volume has declined 1% during 1Q FY23 overall. Uh, rural sales volume grew 3% while urban declined by 4%. So uh, you see, I mean, uh, rural kind of outperforming compared to urban. Uh, and uh, urban is uh, two third of the business overall in FMCG sector. A growth in rural was aided by higher sale of soft drinks, juices, and squashes, whereas urban declined further on a negative base. Uh, at category level, personal care declined by 4%, household by 2%, and uh, food and beverages by 1.5%. So maximum decline has been witnessed in the personal care segment, which is relatively more discretionary in nature. According to Kantar, unbranded products such as edible oils, butter, and cleaners grew by 7 to 16%, while branded ones grew uh, declined by 2 to 11 percent so this kind of explains that there is a shift from branded to unbranded because of the uh, rapid inflation which is there into the uh, economy fmcg companies have hiked prices by 15 to 20 percent since last two years and are likely to continue with price increases in coming months however frequency of price hikes is expected to decline due to softening of raw material prices and uh, last update is on irctc so there was concern on data monetization so IRCTC has made an announcement that uh, it uh, won't be doing so currently and they await for ministry decisions. Uh, so they are basically waiting for data protection bill. Once that comes into picture after that, IRCTC will make a decision with regards to how to use the data, data for monetization. Company also says that they will give customers options to choose whether they want to participate uh, uh, into this um, uh, monetization of data or they don't want to participate. Uh, so overall, I think uh, the uh, the clarification was much required given the concerns uh, which was uh, which were circulating in the industry. Uh, so that's it from my side. I now request uh, Prabhakar sir to please take over the call from here. Uh, thank you, sir. Good morning, everyone. So first update from TVS Electronics. TVS Electronics executed a business transfer agreement with GTID Solution Development to enter into mobile POS software solution and authentication solution space, offering hardware along with required application, digital payment solution, cloud computing software solution uh, to segments like retail, banks, and government. TVS Electronics will acquire business and IP rights of GTID solution. So TVS Electronics expect the transaction to be complete on or before October 31, 2022. So next update on Trilate India. Yesterday, company reported uh, numbers. So overall reported a uh, two-fold increase in its net profit. That is 67.59 crore during the fourth quarter ended June uh, 30, 2022. Uh, company uh, led by strong sales growth. Uh, its revenue from operation increase 26.81% uh, to uh, 550, uh, 552.89 crore. So next update on NTPC. Uh, NTPC uh, Limited has commissioned the first part of uh, the 20 megawatt uh, Ganda solar power project at Gandhar in Gujarat. So company now making in its fourth successful renewable energy project commission this month. 
then next up it godrej agrovet uh, company uh, diversified godrej agrovet on the announced it has signed the mou with assam manipur and tripura governments uh, for the development and promotion of oil palm cultivation in three states under the national mission on edible oils uh, palm scheme so india is the net importer of a uh, palm oil next update on hdfc bank and kanara bank this both bank uh, plans to raise funds worth around 2500 crore through issuance of tier one bonds in order to uh, fund reboost uh, credit growth so according to the reports hdfc bank tier one bonds could be priced around 7.9 to 7.95 percentage next update on lnt lnt has back contracts worth 2500 crore and 5000 crore from indian oil corporation the company will help to set up reduce hydro cracker units of ioc panipat refinery expansion which will uh, meet rising demand for a petroleum product next update on zomato uh, food delivery firm zomato plans to discontinue their pro and pro plus program for its customer now the firm is now closely working with its customer and restaurant partners to craft a new program the development comes at a time when zomato acquired a blinkit uh, for rupees 4447 crore in all stock deal then next update on last update on uh, somani uh, somani ceramics company has all grade open in the uh, first open in the gujarat so that's it from mine i will hand over to prabhakar sir for further research update thank you thank you shitija good morning team um, we the last two days we have seen very good correction from almost uh, uh, we were near 18000 from there we are now almost 17400 now and uh, after 42 trading days of uh, non stop rally and one data says that uh, this is the biggest rally since 2004 or uh, the kind of rally we saw without a correction you know after that you know correction was due and you know there are multiple factors which are making this correction possible also we need to understand except for india most of the world is nearing recession or they are in a very bad shape you know europe you know in the last few days gas prices have jumped huge and europe is in very big trouble now and due to higher gas prices india will have a benefit because many goods will be manufactured and exported from india but you know it will take time we need to also ramp up our capacity so you know there are short term pressures on the market so we need to be careful when varun was updating he updated about infosys where you know the variable salary will be only 70% you know and already wipro has done it few other companies have done it so this indicates that there is weakness in us also you know because you know you are getting now you are getting lot of employees other thing is the order is slowing down also so this is very negative for it stocks so it recovery will take time you have to understand every bull market will have its own set of sectors so this time it is not metals it is not it so it and metal will correct you know whenever there is a correction they will correct more than the market this rally is more towards banking you know your life insurance you know uh, you are you know qsr you know, like jubilee and food and other things you now deviani trend titan you know more of consumables you are capital goods so you know then these stocks correct you have to slowly buy you cannot buy at one single go because we don't know whether the correction will be for 10 or 15 or 20 days you no know, but when correction starts you know you will have rally you know, maybe today evening market will recover from the lowest point because the short covering is slightly covered so there can be recovery but you need to understand you have to be in stock where you will get the recovery so you have to be in the right stock you know buying it or by being in metal will not help you at this point of time you know and you know the stocks which we like you know are you know so, but you need you cannot buy it in one single go 
एच डी एफ सी लाइफ एस बी ए लाइफ आईसीएसए प्रूव गुजरात आल्कली केमिकल ट्रेंड टाइटन देवयानी जूबलियन फूड वी लाइक इवन वी लाइक कैनरा बैंक बैंक ऑफ बड़ोडा ICICI bank but you need to understand when markets are correcting everything will fall so you, you know if you are planning to buy for 100 shares you have to buy 10 10 shares for the next 10 days so that you get a better average buying in one single go you will not get a good price and uh, the order you know sr sw solar has emerged the low, lowest bidder for ntpc solar pv plant where the order size is 2200 crores Which is positive for them. Devayani today will have a block deal. About 2.9 percent of the stock will transact 650 crores. So due to block deal, the stock comes down. Now that is going to be positive for Devayani. You can start buying Devayani. With that, Brijesh, uh, over to you. Uh, अभी हम ये कॉल तो एक बार हिंदी में कर लेते हैं आज के जो भी रिसर्च के आउटलुक्स पे तो मैं स्टार्ट करता हूँ लेमन ट्री के लेमन ट्री से लेमन ट्री ने अनाउंस किया कि वो नए होटल्स हुबली कर्नाटका में खोलने जा रहे हैं और ये ऑपरेशनल होगा मई 2023 पे और ये मैनेज होगा वहाँ पे कार्नेशन होटल प्राइवेट लिमिटेड उनके थ्रू तो इस वजह से क्या होगा कि उनके आ, उनके 65 फाइव वेल अपॉइंटेड रूम्स होंगे वहाँ पे और जिसके रेस्टोरेंट्स बार स्पा स्विमिंग पूल्स और फिटनेस सेंटर्स होंगे ये बेसिकली पॉजिटिव है लेमन ट्रिक के लिए और हमारा ऑलरेडी इसमें होगा क्या कि इसमें और जो एफ आई ट्वेंटी फाइव कंपनी प्लान करे कि थाउजेंड सिक्स टेन थाउजेंड सिक्स सेवेंटी फाइव रूम और एड कर और एड हो जाएंगे जो लगभग एक सौ दस होटल और एडिशन होगा तो ओवरऑल लेवन ट्री पे हमारा पॉजिटिव व्यू है हम इसका टारगेट में सेवेंटी एट मेंटेन कर रहे हैं दूसरा अपडेट है इंडियन होटल्स के ऊपर इंडियन होटल्स ने नया होटल जिंजर जिंजर होटल ओपन किया आर टी ओ सर था अहमदाबाद में इसमें भी हाँ एक सौ ग्यारह रूम्स रहेंगे इंक्लूडिंग सूट्स सूट्स वगैरह तो ये भी इंडियन होटल्स के लिए पॉजिटिव रहेगा इसमें हमारा प्राइस आगे है 302। इसके बाद न्यूज अपडेट है टीसीएस के ऊपर टीसीएस ने वेरिएबल पे के ऊपर अपने 70 परसेंट जो है उसका वेरिएबल पे के ऊपर उन्होंने एम्फोसाइज किया है सॉरी टीसीएस ने इन्फोसिस इन्फोसिस ने अनाउंस किया कि उनके सेवेंटी परसेंट वेरिएबल पे के ऊपर होगा ये उसके यूएस uh, में जो स्लो डाउन चलते हैं वो सेल्स ज्यादा इंप्रूव नहीं होने की वजह से ये उन्होंने इंफोसिस uh, में ये किया हुआ विच इज स्लाइटली नेगेटिव फॉर द स्टॉक टी सी एस के बात करते तो टी सी एस को एक ऑर्डर मिला है साउथ अफ्रीका के अबाइस का कॉपरेट एंड इन्वेस्टमेंट बैंक से जहाँ पे वो टी सी एस अपने डिजिटल ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन करेगा ये स्लाइटली पॉजिटिव रहेगा टी सी एस के लिए टी सी एस के लिए हमारा टारगेट पैस है तीन हजार एक सौ दस तो टी सी एस पे हमारा पॉजिटिव व्यू है उसके बाद चलते एफ एम सी जी सेक्टर में एफ एम जी एफ एम सी जी में कांटा रिपोर्ट ये एक एजेंसी है जो नॉर्मली डेटा कलेक्ट करके उसके व्यूज बताती है उसने बताया कि एफ एम सी जी के जो वॉल्यूम से वो डिक्लाइन हुए ड्यूरिंग द करेंट फाइनेंशियल ईयर ट्वेंटी थ्री में सो बेसिकली ये हुआ ऐसा है कि बहुत सारे जो प्रोडक्ट है जैसे एडिबल ऑयल बटर्स और क्लीनर्स ये सब घटा है सेवन परसेंट के करीब ऑयल ब्रांडेड सॉरी ये बड़ा है सेवन परसेंट बट इसके मुकाबले जो ब्रांडेड प्रोडक्ट है वो घटा है टू परसेंट तो ब्रांडेड प्रोडक्ट्स में घटोटी आई है और जो अनब्रांडेड है उसमें आपको उछाल देखने को मिला है इसका मतलब एक मेजर रीजन ये भी है क्योंकि एफ एम जी जी जो ब्रांडेड कंपनी उन्होंने अपने प्राइसेस हाई किए फिफ्टीन टू ट्वेंटी परसेंट और वो बता रहे हैं कि आने वाले दिनों में भी शायद ये प्राइस हाई करते रहेंगे इस वजह से एफ एम जी जी स्टॉक्स में आपको प्रेशर देखने को मिल रहा है उसके बाद हम चलते हैं टीवी एस मोटर टीवीएस इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स की तरफ उन्होंने एक एग्रीमेंट साइन किया है जी टी सॉल्यूशन डेवलपमेंट के तरफ जिसमें वो मोबाइल सॉफ्टवेयर सॉल्यूशंस और ऑथेंटिकेशन सॉल्यूशंस का डेवलपमेंट करेंगे ये 
ये कंप्लीट होगा अक्टूबर थर्टी फर्स्ट टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी टू तो ये पॉजिटिव न्यूज है बेसिकली टीसीएस के लिए उसके बाद है एनटीपीसी द एनटीपीसी ने ट्वेंटी मेगावाट का कांडा सोलार पीवी प्रोजेक्ट में वापस कमीशन किया है गुजरात में सो ये इसके वजह से उसका ये फोर्थ सक्सेसफुल कमीशन होगा ये करेंट मंथ जिस ये और इसका जो रेट परसेंटेज रहेगा सेवन पॉइंट नाइन से सेवन पॉइंट नाइन फाइव परसेंट एल एन टी एल एन टी ने फिर से एक ऑर्डर बुक मिला है ट्वेंटी फाइव हंड्रेड क्लोज का और फाइव थाउजेंड क्लोज फ्रॉम इंडियन ऑयल तो ये ये हेल्प करेगा ये हाइड्रो फैसा यूनिट तो आईओ सी पानीपत रिफाइनरी एक्सपेंशन एक्सपेंशन में जो जिससे उनके जो पेट्रोलियम के जो डिमांड्स है वो मीट कर पाए तो अगेन ये पॉजिटिव न्यूज रहेगा एल एन टी के लिए इससे आगे चलते हैं हम थोड़ा सा ग्लोबल मार्केट की तरफ ग्लोबल मार्केट में हमने देखा है कि ओवरऑल सिनारियो इतना काफी अच्छा नहीं है थोड़ा सा रिसेशन का जैसे माहौल है गैस क्राइसिस बढ़ रहे हैं यूरोप यूरोप भी ओवरऑल थोड़े से प्रॉब्लम में ही चल रहा है तो यूरोप का प्रॉब्लम में होना ये हमारे लिए थोड़ा सा इंडिया के पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू से थोड़ा सा अच्छा है तो दिस इज स्लाइटली पॉजिटिव फॉर इंडिया पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू तो तो हमें ये लग रहा है कि यूएस में शॉर्ट टर्म में थोड़ा प्रेशर मेंटेन रहेगा ये यही रीजन है कि इंफोसिस में या फिर अपने पहले विप्रो में भी देखा होगा कि वो कंपनी जो वेरिएबल पे के स्ट्रक्चर में जा रही है जैसे कि हमें पता है कि इंफोसिस ने 70 परसेंट वेरिएबल पे में वेरिएबल पे पे के स्ट्रक्चर में ऑलरेडी उन्होंने अनाउंस कर चुका है यूएस में उनको वीकनेस लगता है और उनके ऑर्डर बुक्स लो है तो जिस इस वजह से और आईटी स्टॉक्स का हम, हम, हमारा व्यू वैसे भी थोड़ा सा मंडी की तरफ था तो मुझे हमें लगता है कि ये आईटी थोड़ा सा वीक रहेगा और आईटी के साथ आप मेटल में भी देखोगे तो ये दोनों सेक्टर ही उतने परफॉर्म नहीं करेंगे तो इसके, इसके चलते हुए सिर्फ बैंकिंग और लाइफ इंश्योरेंस और कुछ यूएसआर जैसे जुबिलेंट है ट्रेंट है टाइटन है सिलेक्टेड आपके कैपिटल गुड्स है तो ये सेक्टर्स में आपको शायद नीचे की तरफ बाइंग अपॉर्चुनिटी मिल सकता है बट देन वेरी स्ट्रिक्टली आप आईटीओ मेटल्स के काउंटर्स को तो फिलहाल के लिए आप अवॉइड कर चाहिए अभी तो मार्केट करेक्शन चल रहा है तो स्टॉक स्पेसिफिक है काफी सारा तो क्लियरली uh, हम बता रहे की आईटीओ मेटल्स को अवॉइड करना है कुछ बाइंग स्टॉक्स में लाइक एच जी एफ सी लाइक एस बी आई लाइक गुजरात अलकली ट्रेंड टाइटन देवयानी जुबीलैंड बैंक में आप देखोगे तो कैनरा बैंक बैंक ऑफ इंडिया फिर प्राइवेट बैंक में आईसीआईसी बैंक ये कुछ बैंक है ये कुछ स्टॉक्स है जो आप डिक्लाइंस पे आपको बाय करनी चाहिए हम ये नहीं बता रहे कि सब एक साथ करना चाहिए आप आपको अगर हंड्रेड क्वान्टिटी बाय करना हो टेन 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 के रेशियोज में आप बाय करिए सो देट आप मार्केट करेक्शन में आप उसको लिवरेज कर पाए एच डब्ल्यू सोलर का बीड आया है 2200 करोड़ का एनटीपीसी की तरफ तो ये पॉजिटिव न्यूज रहेगा और एक दिव्यानी में आज एक ब्लॉकिल एक्सपेक्टेड है तो जिस वजह से स्टॉक शायद नीचे आएगा तो ये अगर वो अपॉर्चुनिटी होती है तो ये बाइंग अपॉर्चुनिटी होगा क्योंकि हमारे दिव्यानी पे पॉजिटिव व्यू है थैंक यू फ्रॉम आवर एंड